Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to deal with quality management in Odoo 13. In a business, it is necessary that you provide your customers with good quality products. In order to provide good quality products, the business has to conduct several quality checks prior to bringing final. The product must be evaluated in different stages so as to assure its standard compliance. Utilizing Odoo, one can set different quality check at different stages in different ways. Let us go to quality management module. So we shall go to the quality module. This is the quality module. Let's open it. So this is the opening view of the quality module. And here we can see the Kanban view of quality management teams. So first of all, create quality team. For that, go to configuration, quality teams. Here we shall click on create button to create quality teams. So this is the form to create quality teams. This is the main quality team. Here we shall give the email alias and we shall mention the company to After filling all this, let's save it. This is the quality team. Let's go back. Now we can go to the quality control. There we can see quality control points. So open it. This is the quality control points. Here we have already created few quality control points for different products. We shall create another one. This is the form to create quality control points. So we shall give a title for this quality control point. Then we shall give the product. Then we shall mention the operation. The time on which this quality control point is active. We shall keep it on receipts. Mainly we have three operations here. Receipts, delivery and manufacturing. Receipts means when a product receives to our company, the quality operation takes place. Then delivery means at the time of delivering a product, then at the time of manufacturing a product. Then we have control types. Here we have three control types like all operations randomly and periodically. All operation means the quality check takes place at every operations. Then if we give randomly, a new field will come like control frequency we have to mention the frequency of control and if we give periodically the control frequency is on days weeks or months we have to set it as we wish let's keep it in all operations then we have types here we have four types text take a picture pass or fail measure this is the quality check that is active so here we are keeping pass or fail then we shall assign a team here here we are assigned a main quality team then if we have any instructions for the team we can mention here then if the quality check is failed what we have to do 
that must be mentioned here now we shall save it so we have saved it so the operation for the product acoustic block screens is set as receipts so now we shall go to the purchase module and create a purchase order for the product acoustic block and let's see what happens let's go to the purchase module let's create a purchase order let's give a vendor and the product acoustic block screen and let us confirm the order so we have confirmed the order and we shall go to the receipts to receive the product so here we can see that at the time of receipts here a new button appeared quality checks This is the effect of quality check control point we have set in the quality module for this product. So let's click on the quality check. Then a pop up wizard will come like this. Is it pass or fail? So a company have to thoroughly check the product and if it is pass they can give pass or if there is any damage they can keep it on fail. Then here we are giving it a pass. Now we shall validate it and proceed the purchase. So we have received the products. Now let us see what happens if the quality check is failed. Let's create another purchase order. We shall give the same product. Let's confirm the order and receive the products. So what happens if we click on the fail? Quality check failed. Okay. So if the quality check is failed, a new button appears called quality alert. So here clicking on it, we can give an alert to the quality team about this product. So this is the quality alert form and the product is automatically populated here and we shall give a title here we can define the description about the damages also we can mention in the corrective actions what has to be done for correcting this damage also we can mention the preventive actions here and so on and under miscellaneous we can mention the vendor company and alert date and so on and this quality alert will be gone to the main quality team because we have already assign the quality check for this main quality team and let us save it now let us go back to the quality module under main quality team we can see quality alert tab so here we can see the new quality alert that is automatically created when the product is failed the quality check 
now the team can confirm the quality alert and they can do the proposed actions for the corrective measures of this product now when we go to quality control we can see quality checks so here we can see all the quality checks that the company have been doing this is the quality checks that we have done just now acoustic block screens passed and failed now again under the quality control we can see the quality alert tab so this is the quality alerts that have been created now under reporting we can see the quality check and quality alert reports this is the quality check report also we have quality alert reports so this is all about quality management under odu 30 thank you for watching if you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any odu implementation or customization in your business drop your request to info@cybrosis.com